The traditional African religions or traditional beliefs and practices of African people are a set of highly diverse beliefs that include various ethnic religions. Generally, these traditions are oral rather than scriptural, include belief in a supreme creator, belief in spirits, veneration of the dead, use of magic and traditional medicine. The role of humanity is generally seen as one of harmonizing nature with the supernatural. Topic. Spread. Adherents of traditional religions in sub-Saharan Africa are distributed among 43 countries and are estimated to number over 100 million. Although the majority of Africans are adherents of Christianity or Islam, African people often combine the practice of their traditional belief with the practice of Abrahamic religions. The two Abrahamic religions are widespread across Africa, though mostly concentrated in different areas. They have replaced indigenous African religions, but are often adapted to African cultural contexts and belief systems. Ceremonies West and Central African religious practices generally manifest themselves in communal ceremonies or divinatory rites in which members of the community, overcome by force or ash, nyama, etc., are excited to the point of going into meditative trance in response to rhythmic or driving drumming or singing. One religious ceremony practiced in Gabon and Cameroon is the Okuyi, practiced by several Bantu ethnic groups. In this state, depending upon the region, drumming or instrumental rhythms played by respected musicians each of which is unique to a given deity or ancestor, participants embody a deity or ancestor, energy or state of mind by performing distinct ritual movements or dances which further enhance their elevated consciousness. When this trance-like state is witnessed and understood, adherents are privy to a way of contemplating the pure or symbolic embodiment of a particular mindset or frame of reference. This builds skills at separating the feelings elicited by this mindset from their situational manifestations in daily life. Such separation and subsequent contemplation of the nature and sources of pure energy or feelings serves to help participants manage and accept them when they arise in mundane contexts. This facilitates better control and transformation of these energies into positive, culturally appropriate behavior, thought, and speech. Also, this practice can also give rise to those in these trances uttering words which, when interpreted by a culturally educated initiate or diviner, can provide insight into appropriate directions which the community or individual might take in accomplishing its goal. Spirits Topic. Followers of traditional African religions pray to various spirits as well as to their ancestors. These secondary spirits serve as intermediaries between humans and the primary god, also referred to as the supreme deity. Most African societies believe in a single supreme being Chukwu, Nyam, Alodomer, Gai, Rug, etc. Some recognize a dual god and goddess such as Mawu Lisa. <laughs> Practices and rituals there are more similarities than differences in all traditional African religions. Often, the supreme deity is worshipped through consultation or communion with lesser deities and ancestral spirits. The deities and spirits are honored through libation, sacrifice of animals, vegetables, cooked food, flowers, semi-precious stones and precious metals. The will of the supreme deity is sought by the believer also through consultation of divinities or divination. In many traditional African religions, there is a belief in a cyclical nature of reality. The living stand between their ancestors and the unborn. Traditional African religions embrace natural phenomena, ebb and tide, waxing and waning moon, rain and drought, and the rhythmic pattern of agriculture. According to Gottlieb and MBITI, the environment and nature are infused in every aspect of traditional African religions and culture. This is largely because cosmology and beliefs are intricately intertwined with the natural phenomena and environment. All aspects of weather, thunder, lightning, rain, day, moon, sun, stars, and so on may become amenable to control through the cosmology of African people. Natural phenomena are responsible for providing people with their daily needs. For example, in the Sura religion, one of the most sacred stars in the cosmos is called Unar, the star of Sirius. 
With a long farming tradition, the Sur High Priests and Priestesses Salty deliver yearly sermons at the XOY ceremony, divination ceremony in Fadak before Unar's phase in order to predict winter months and enable farmers to start planting. Traditional healers are common in most areas, and their practices include a religious element to varying degrees. Topic. Divination Topic. Since Africa is a large continent with many ethnic groups and cultures, there is not one single technique of casting divination. The practice of casting may be done with small objects, such as bones, cowrie shells, stones, strips of leather, or flat pieces of wood. Some castings are done using sacred divination plates made of wood or performed on the ground often within a circle. In traditional African societies, many people seek out diviners on a regular basis. There are generally no prohibitions against the practice. Diviner also known as priest are also sought for their wisdom as counselors in life and for their knowledge of herbal medicine. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Virtue and Vice. Topic: <inaudible> Virtue in traditional African religion is often connected with carrying out obligations of the communal aspect of life. Examples include social behaviors such as the respect for parents and elders, raising children appropriately, providing hospitality, and being honest, trustworthy, and courageous. In some traditional African religions, morality is associated with obedience or disobedience to God regarding the way a person or a community lives. For the Kikuyu, according to their primary supreme creator, Guy, acting through the lesser deities, is believed to speak to and be capable of guiding the virtuous person as one's conscience. Traditionally, as now, the Kikuyu were monotheists, believing in a unique and omnipotent god whom they called Gai. The word, is related to the Maasai word Ankai, and was borrowed by both the Kikuyu and Kamba. God is also known as Mungu, Murungu, or Mulungu a variant of a word meaning God, which is found as far south as the Zambesi of Zambia, and is sometimes given the title Mawathani or Mawathi the greatest ruler, which comes from the word Gwatha, meaning to rule or reign with authority. Guy is the creator and giver of all things, the divider of the universe and lord of nature. He gave birth to the human community, created the first Kikuyu communities, and provided them with all the resources necessary for life, land, rain, plants and animals. He, for Guy as male, cannot be seen, but is manifest in the sun, moon, stars, comets and meteors, thunder and lighting, rain, in rainbows and in the great fig trees Mugumo that served as places of worship and sacrifice, and which marked the spot at Makoru wa Gathanga where Gikuyu and Mumbi, the ancestors of the Kikuyu in the oral legend, first settled. Yet Guy is not the distant god that we know in the West. He had human characteristics, and although some say that he lives in the sky or in the clouds, they also say that he comes to earth from time to time to inspect it, bestow blessings and mete out punishment. When he comes he rests on Mount Kenya and four other sacred mountains. Thunder is interpreted to be the movement of God, and lightning is God's weapon by means of which he clears the way when moving from one sacred place to another. Other people believed that Guy's abode was on Mount Kenya, or else beyond its peaks. Guy, says one legend, made the mountain his resting place while on an inspection tour of earth. He then took the first man, Gikuyu, to the top to point out the beauty of the land he was giving him. In traditional African religions, such as the Azande religion, a person is said to have a good or bad conscience, depending on whether he does the bidding of God or malevolent spirits. In many cases, Africans who have converted to other religions have still kept up their traditional customs and practices, combining them in a syncretic way. <laughs> Sacred places some sacred or holy locations for traditional religions include Nri Igbo, the point of Sangomar, Yaboyabo, Fadak, Ife, Oyo, Dahomey, Benin City, Wida, Nsukka, Kanem Bornu, Tulwap Kipsigis, and Igbo Ukwu among others. <laughs> Religious persecution Traditions by region Topic. This list is limited to a few well-known traditions. 
Topic Central Africa Topic Bantu mythology Central Southeast Southern Africa Bushongo mythology Congo Lugbara mythology Congo Baluba mythology Congo Budi mythology Congo Dinka religion South Sudan Hausa animism Chad Gabon Lotuko mythology South Sudan Topic East African Topic Bantu mythology Central Southeast Southern Africa Akamba mythology Kenya Maasai mythology Kenya Tanzania Webian Kalenjin mythology Kenya Uganda, Tanzania, Dini ya Misambwa, Bungoma, Trans N Zoya, Kenya. Topic Southern Africa Topic Bantu mythology, Central, Southeast, Southern Africa, Lozi mythology, Zambia, Tumbuka mythology, Malawi, Kosa mythology, Southern Africa, Zulu mythology, South Africa, San religion, South Africa, Traditional healers of South Africa, Manjanjo healers of Chitungwiza of Zimbabwe. Topic West Africa Topic Akan religion, Ghana, Ivory Coast, Dahomey religion, Benin, Togo. Efik mythology, Nigeria, Cameroon, Edo religion, Benin Kingdom, Nigeria, Hausa animism, Benin, Burkina Faso, Cameroon, Cote d'Ivoire, Ghana, Niger, Nigeria, Togo, Odinani, Igbo people, Nigeria, Sura religion, Atat Rug, Senegal, Gambia, Mauritania, Yoruba religion, Nigeria, Benin, Togo, West African Vodun, Ghana, Benin, Togo, Nigeria, Dogon religion, Mali, Topic African diaspora, Topic Topic North Africa, Topic Ancient Ancient Egyptian religion, Egypt, Sudan, traditional Berber religion, Morocco, including Western Sahara, Algeria, Tunisia, Libya, Egypt, Mauritania, Mali, Niger, Chad, Burkina Faso, Hausa animism, Sudan. Topic notes. Topic topic references. Topic information presented here was gleaned from World Eras Encyclopedia, Volume 10, edited by Pierre Damien M. Vuillacour, New York, Thomson Gale, 2003. In particular, pp. 275 to 314. Baldic, J. 1997, Black God, The Afroasiatic Roots of the Jewish, Christian, and Muslim Religions. New York, Syracuse University Press. Dumbia, A. and Dumbia, N. 2004, the Way of the Elders, West African Spirituality and Tradition. St. Paul, M. N., Llewellyn Publications. Eret, Christopher, 2002, The Civilizations of Africa, A History to 1800. Charlottesville, University Press of Virginia. Eret, Christopher, An African Classical Age, Eastern and Southern Africa in World History, 1000 BC to AD 400, page 159, University of Virginia Press, ISBN 0-8139-2057-4 Karade, B. 1994, the Handbook of Yoruba Religious Concepts. York Beach, M.A., Samuel Weiser Inc. Pabitek, Okat. African Religions and Western Scholarship. Kampala, East African Literature Bureau, 1970. Princeton Online, History of Africa Wiredu, Quasi Toward Decolonizing African Philosophy and Religion in African Studies Quarterly, The Online Journal for African Studies, Volume 1, Issue 4, 1998 Topic Further reading Topic Encyclopedia of African Religion, Malefi Asante, Sage Publications, 1412936365 Abambola, Wade, ed. And Trans, 1977. IFA Divination Poetry Knock, New York. Baldick, Julian, 1997. Black God, The Afroasiatic Roots of the Jewish, Christian, and Muslim Religions. Syracuse University Press, ISBN 0-8156-0522-6 Barnes, Sandra. Africa's Ogun, Old World and New, Bloomington, Indiana University Press, 1989. Beyer, Uli, ed. The Origins of Life and Death, African Creation Myths London, Heinemann, 1966. Bowen, P. G. 1970. Sayings of the Ancient One, Wisdom from Ancient Africa. Theosophical Publishing House, U.S. Chittister, David. Religions of South Africa pp. 17-19 Cole, Herbert M. Bari. Art and Life Among the Oari Igbo Bloomington, Indiana University Press, 1982. Dankwa, J.B., The Akan Doctrine of God, A Fragment of Gold Coast Ethics and Religion, 2nd edition, London, Cass, 1968. G. Bottajesson, Segan. African Philosophy, Traditional Yoruba Philosophy and Contemporary African Realities, New York, Peter Lang, 1999. Gleason, Judith. Oya, In Praise of an African Goddess, Harper Collins, 1992. Griot, Marcel, Dieterlin, Germain. La Mythe Cosmogonique, Paris, Institut d'Ethnologie, 1965. 
Adou, Balaji, God in Yoruba Belief, Plainview, Original Publications, Rev. and Enlarged Ed. 1995. Lagama, Elisa. 2000. Art and Oracle: African Art and Rituals of Divination. New York: The Metropolitan Museum of Art. ISBN 9780870999333. Archived from the original on the 10th of May 2013. Lugira, Aloysius Mazanganda. African Traditional Religion. Infobase Publishing, 2009. MBITI, John African Religions and Philosophy 1969 African Writers Series, Hyman ISBN 0-435-89591-5 Apoku, Kofi Asari 1978. West African Traditional Religion Kofi Asari Apoku, Publisher, FEP International Private Limited. ASIN, B-O-O-O-E-E-O-I-T Perinder, Jeffrey. African Traditional Religion, 3rd ed., London, Sheldon Press, 1974. ISBN 0-85969-014-8 PBK. Perinder, Geoffrey. Traditional Religion, in His Africa's Three Religions, 2nd ed., London, Sheldon Press, 1976, ISBN 0-85969-096-2, p. 1596. Peavy, D. 2009, Kings, Magic and Medicine. Raleigh, North Carolina, S.I. Peavy, D. 2016. The Benin Monarchy, Olakun and Iha Amanigban. Umawayan, Journal of Benin and Edoid Studies, Oswego, N.Y. Papula, S. Solagbade. Akunle Abayamo, It is on Bent Knees That I Gave Birth 2007 Asif and Media Publication Shoyinka, Wole, Myth, Literature and the African World Cambridge University Press, 1976. Alice Werner, Myths and Legends of the Bantu 1933. Available online here http colon slash slash www.sacred-texts.com slash afr slash mlb slash index htm umayasigbu, rems nna. The Way We Lived, IBO Customs and Stories London, Heinemann, 1969. Topic external links Topic African Comparative Belief Africa World.net A website with extensive links and information about traditional African religions Baba Alawoy.com Baba Woawoyanfa Ifaloju, showcasing IFA using web media 2.0 Blogs, podcasting, video and photocasting Culture Exchange. Blog, Animism Modern Africa An article explaining the parallels between traditional and modern religious practices in Africa.